Hey folks, your OS Reviews. You're watching our video first look and a quick review of the FCONT F18. This is a foldable wireless Bluetooth keyboard that works with smartphones and tablets so you can get a larger, more comfortable, tactile typing experience as opposed to the typical virtual keys you have on screen. It's also one of the most compact Bluetooth keyboards that I've ever seen, and it sells on Amazon for sub 45 bucks, a little bit on the pricier side of the spectrum, but you are paying a bit more for this unique look that folds up completely and also acts as a stand for your device. It uses typical Bluetooth, so it's wireless um, and has a pretty typical 33 feet range, works with computers and um, even Mac and, and uh, Windows in case you need to do that. To match the design language of current iOS products, you can see the color scheme here is also matched. There's a rose gold version and a space gray version, so they both will look the same as far as the tone as you know, latest gen of iPhones and iPads out there. So in terms of charging, we have a pretty typical micro USB cable for power, and it takes about two hours to completely charge. Afterwards, you can use this for, I would say about two to three months before you need to recharge it again with sporadic usage, turning it on or off in between. Pairing, you just need to pair it once. Afterwards, it remembers your device automatically. This is what it looks like as far as the controls um, and uh, the keys themselves and the multifunction keys in the very top. So pretty easy to set up. And let's just take a quick look at the design of the keyboard. So as far as the build quality is concerned, it's made out of a fusion between aluminum as well as plastic materials. So it does feel very substantial, even though it's quite slim. Uh, I have a ballpoint pen over here. You can see the size difference there is very minimal. Um, I have to say it's a bit hefty because it is quite premium in terms of its fit and finish. It folds up and let's see if we can open this up here and see what happens. So this is probably the stand part and then it looks like this is the keyboard part. And once I've unfolded it, it looks like the keyboard itself turns on automatically. There's an LED light there to tell me that that has been detected and it's probably going to be on and now pairing. So you can see that even though it's a completely foldable keyboard, the size of the unit when fully deployed is similar to what you might find on a smaller Chromebook or a, a ultra portable. It's not a full size keyboard you might find on a 15.6 inch laptop or a super spacious keyboard, but it still is relatively comfortable to type on and everything is nice and easy to use, including the space bar, which is nice, nicely tactile. For such a slim keyboard, it also has a great travel to it. So it's an island style keyboard, uh, very similar to what you might find on uh, MacBooks and uh, similar devices that have this type of layout. There's uh, four up, down, right, uh, up, down, left, and right keys for scrolling, and the very top feature is some of the shortcut keys for Android as well as media controls such as search, play, pause, skip tracks, as well as volume controls. So those are pretty easy to use. Let's take a quick look at the stand. It looks like there's another portion that slides out as such to provide an elevated angle when you want to pop on, let's say, your phone for typing purposes at this one particular angle, maybe setting at another angle. So it uh, is nicely thought out as far as all the ergonomics are concerned. Let's do a quick demo of that typing experience. So pairing is extremely swift, just takes about 10 seconds once you open up the Bluetooth app on your phone and then tap on function and the Bluetooth icon here. Hold on this, once you see the LED start to flash, you can start pairing. Very simple and we had no issues. The controls as far as going back to the home screen, everything works really well. I can navigate around, use this as a typical keyboard. You can see that pops up on screen. So everything is quite comfortable and easy to use. Let's do a quick typing test as well to give you guys an idea of what the uh, experience here is like. So let's say this is a test. You can see there's very minimal lag as far as the keyboard is concerned. Whatever I type on on screen seems to pop up on the display very quickly and obviously speeds up my productivity if I have a Word document or a Google Doc that's open and working with someone collaborating. It's going to be a lot easier than pecking out letters on a keyboard. And so it, um, you know, it actually works really well. So everything seems to be quite responsive. Uh, the quick brown fox. And again, the travel is actually surprisingly decent for such a small compact form factor. Um, obviously, you're paying a bit more for premium for this really unique look, but it is something that works quite well. You can comfortably sit a, a larger device like a tablet on here as well. And once you're done, you simply pop this out, put in this, and then everything just folds up again, automatically turns off, and magnets hold things into place, and you're ready to go. So obviously, one of the most uh, unique foldable keyboards that I've seen. So certainly something that you should check out if portability is your number one concern. It is extremely stylish and works a lot better than I expected as far as the size and the overall construction um, of, of the unit. So obviously it's not going to meant for people who do super long 
processing, if you want a, the most spacious keyboard in the world, it's not going to be for you. It's not going to compare to mechanical keyboards. But again, it's really meant for people who want that portability and emphasize that point when they are traveling or on the go. We can check out more details about this in our official written review, but for now, this has been our video. Thanks for watching here at OS Reviews. This has been the F18 by FCONT. This is an extremely portable folding Bluetooth.